Hello, I'm Deborah Pascali Bonaro, and I am coming to you with Ask a Doula. I thought it would be fun to start a series with you because people ask me so many questions all the time. Sometimes I'm called the Orgasmic Doula, and I'm here because I'm the director of Orgasmic Birth, the best kept secret. So I know that many of you that are here on Facebook have already seen our documentary, but people say all the time, what is orgasmic birth? So I thought I'd come to you today in the book, Orgasmic Birth, the, your guide to a safe, satisfying, and pleasurable birth experience. Elizabeth Davis and I define orgasmic birth, and we say our definition is broad enough to include those who describe birth as ecstatic, and specific enough to give voice to those who actually feel the contractions of orgasm and climax at the moment of delivery. And that's called a birthgasm. Many of our interviewees spoke of astounding pressure and sensation in the vagina as birth approached, followed by a flood of release and emotion as the baby emerged. Whenever a woman, a person can look back on these moments with joy when the physical and emotional aspects of birth are fully experienced as pleasurable. We call this orgasmic birth. So I want you to really think about that because so many people hear orgasmic birth. And if you haven't seen the film, you really make your own assumptions up. I think the film helps you understand our definition that there are people that have a birthgasm, but that shouldn't be a performance standard. I certainly don't want people feeling orgasm is something to put on your birth plan. On the other hand, so many people that have a birthgasm have so much shame that they felt this immense pleasure when everyone else feels pain that they don't tell anybody. I've had people come up to me after huge screenings and they wait hour till everyone's gone. And with their head down, they almost whisper to me, I had that, I had a birthgasm. And I've had people that didn't tell their partner, didn't tell their best friend, certainly didn't tell anyone publicly because they thought something was wrong. So it is important that orgasmic birth does give permission to say birth is a part of our intimate, sacred sexuality. And there are so many ways that we can birth with love, with joy, with pleasure, with ecstasy. And so anytime you have birth where there are moments of joy, moments of pleasure, where you birth in love, where you're respected and honored, you're part of decision making, you birth where and with whom you desire, that's orgasmic birth. So I'm gonna keep coming to you with lots of questions that I'll answer for you. And I hope that you'll ask me questions. If you have a question, whether it's about doulas in general, birth in general, I am a Lamaze certified childbirth educator. I'm a Dona International birth and postpartum doula trainer. I've written books all about the sexuality of pregnancy, birth, and postpartum. And I'm really here to start a conversation so your questions can be answered and we can have fun together. So I'm really looking forward to hearing from you. Please write your questions below this post, share your comments, and I would love to talk to you. Have a blessed day.